it, guys. So today we are breaking down the 1887 for the medium, my overall thoughts of this gun, and later a giveaway. But let's dive into this. This gun is actually one of my favorites. I think it's an S tier weapon. I think it's on par with the F car and the AKM due to it being one of the best body shot kind of weapons that are out there and it has no recoil. Zero recoil, moving, sliding, crouch, whatever, it has no recoil. Now, I think the one downside of this gun that some people might say is that it has six rounds, but at the, but you can also reload mid and you know road, reload like two shells and keep going. You don't have to do a full reload. The reload can be a little slow, but like I said, this gun, can wipe out pretty much any class and you can almost you can also wipe out a whole team now if the whole team is all lights and all mediums full team wipe with all six rounds as long as you hit your shots right now if there's a heavy in the mix no matter what it's going to take more shots at the end of the day and another reason why you saw in the breakdown that the headshots are actually more than the body is due to the spread if you are shooting at the head you're probably going to miss at least two pelts if not more when aiming at the head whereas if you're hitting the body all eight pellets are going to hit and land and deal out and dish that damage so this weapon flourishes on the body shot so don't don't aim for the head for this gun always aim for the body or lower extremities because you you want all those pelts to to hit um and that's just kind of my overall thoughts of this gun I think it's not necessarily a sleeper, but people people are using it. And I think people prefer to use the AKM or the F car and like ranked and all that. I think this gun should be used a lot more in my opinion. Um, it's a blast to use. I feel highly rewarded killing people with the shotgun. I can't recommend this more. I don't know, maybe you guys have some thoughts on how this gun could do better, but I, I, think, it's, I think it is nicely balanced. Hey guys, so it's time for the free giveaway. There's no purchase necessary. I'm excited to do this. We hit the 200 subscriber mark, and this is just kind of a thank you to you guys for being part of the community, and I just wanna give back to you guys. So how do you win the Valve $25 gift card towards the finals battle pass? Well, it's a subscriber giveaway, so if you're not already a subscriber to this channel, please hit the subscriber and you don't have to unsubscribe, resubscribe to be a part of this. Just be a subscriber and then click into this description of this video and leave a comment of which class and weapon is your favorite in the finals. That is all you need to do in seven days time on September 25th, I'll return to this video and I will select one winner at random. I will pin that comment and ask them to reply to my comment then email me at jarrettlelanddiy at gmail.com. We'll change some pleasantries. I'll get some of your information and then I'll send you the Valve Steam $25 gift card so you can apply it towards the finals battle pass the next day that it comes out. Now, nowhere in this did you hear me or make a suggestion that I'll ask you for any money or telegram me or WhatsApp me or any of that nonsense. So if someone approaches you pretending to be me or it doesn't sound like me, chances are it's a scam. Okay, guys, so don't get scammed. I don't want you guys to get scammed. I'm never gonna ask for a cent from you guys for any of these giveaways. So good luck out there. And if you don't win, there'll be more coming down the pipeline. So thanks again, guys, and let's get back to the video. I would say this, sh this shotgun feels too overpowering, but I can see why in some cases someone might feel that way. But I don't know. I I think this is substantially way more fun than the melee, just blasting off shotgun rounds. Um, it puts the medium in that close to me. The close to medium range is detrimental to any class with this this weapon. And it is a like I said, this is so much fun to use. I think a lot of people prefer the ARs just because they're substantially more forgiving and I think I want to say their damage profile is both the AKM and the F car. I want to say you could wipe out, you, you have a better chance of wiping out a, a team that's like a medium light and heavy whereas this one you can't do that as well. Maybe, you know, you could argue like, oh, you know, maybe if you added a, another round to it, you could you could wipe out a whole class of me. But I, I don't think that would be uh, a good thing, in my opinion. 
I still think this weapon is probably one of the best balanced shotguns in in the finals. But let me know you, what you guys thought. Like, is it well balanced? Is it not? But that's just kind of my overall thoughts of this weapon. Uh, some specs of it. You know, uh, let me know outside of the giveaway in the comments what you guys think of this shotgun. Um, but thanks again, guys. And I hope to catch you guys on the finals. And I can't wait for this new season. But you know what? You guys have a good one. Nice, and catch you guys later. On behalf of our sponsors, thanks for tuning in. And that's a wrap.